system season okay so I have my solar system mug makes me teacher happy friends all right so this season has been interesting for sure uh, the kids are no longer elementary to middle school age but they're like middle school high school and I can't believe I'm saying that almost um, and while I've been incredibly excited about it all I think that I have grieved quite a bit. I am forever missing how things were, what feels like just yesterday. And I'm always thinking about ideas and plans that didn't pan out quite uh, like I thought they would. So where am I right now? Right now I am I guess I just spent a lot of time shifting my perspective from grief to gratitude. Um, and that has been everything for me. Uh, I think I haven't allowed myself to talk about it much because I realize what a privilege um, it has been to be there every step of the way. Um, to remember and have been a part of like every milestone and every mishap and all the aha moments um, and all the time when they've connected the dots. Um, every essay, every project, uh, every book they've read and story that they've written or told, like honestly the blessings that have uh, followed the sacrifices that we've made to homeschool. Uh, they've been a lot. It's It's been a blessing for sure. Um, and now, like, they are still with me and I am still with them. Uh, but things are very different around here. These seasons have been so full. There is quite a bit of come and go. And Ooh, that is not your friend. <laughs> I mean, are we still friends? It's been a minute, but are we still friends? Uh, let me know. That is just not in my nature. So usually when things feel more busy, uh, they seem chaotic to me. And I very much so feel like I'm out of control. Um, I'm learning that that is not the case, that I am okay. That is not actual chaos and that the busyness is purposeful and it's good. Everything now has to be even more intentional than it's ever been before um, and it feels exhausting. Like discipline is the name of the game these days and well discipline especially for me is, is 
it's hard. <laughs> it feels so much like putting myself in a box. And of course that is like not happening, but it's kind of happening. It feels like it's happening. It's coming off of a grieving season. And lately I've spent way too much energy considering what I didn't do well um, in the past and dealing with those emotions and uh, not nearly enough on thinking of all the beautiful things that lie ahead. I mean, it is what I have always done such a good job of since starting our homeschool journey. Um, I've never been really led by the fear of. It's always been walking in faith of all that lies ahead. Um, and yet somehow I feel like I have forgotten my own superpower. Uh, like what has made, you know, things so good uh, in this journey. And, but the way my emotions are out here portraying me in these seasons have been ridiculous. Um, I have honestly isolated myself quite a bit. And I think that's because when I get that feeling like I am not in as much control of life and my days as I'd like to be. Um, I feel like I must be insufferable to others, you know? And so I just slowly started to um, isolate, uh, thinking that that was helping me to cope. And I think it, it has, uh, maybe not the healthiest way of coping. And of course, this is this conversation is very, very dramatic. Um, but I mean, I can be pretty dramatic um, from time to time, and that's okay. I'm okay with that. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So I've isolated myself quite a bit. Um, I've gained quite a bit of weight which is very significant uh, because I think that the weight I've gained on the outside is definitely telling of the things that I'm carrying. Um, and so, I can I say that I don't mind that? I don't feel bad about it. I definitely feel like it's time to let a lot of that weight go. So, that is also happening right now in this season. Um, I have been dealing with the most random of symptoms uh, that really have been born out of anxiety for sure, which uh, I don't want any parts of. So I've been working on that. And the disciplines in my days, when I do get them right, uh, they are really keeping me. Um, my routines in the day, uh, the things that are the same, um, on a daily basis, uh, doing things the same thing, exactly the same way every day has been keeping me from drifting to places that I really don't need to go. Yeah, so it's time to let some stuff go. Like I said, this all sounds really dramatic, but I think that a lot of the work that we do on the inside um, can seem very dramatic, but it produces good things on the outside. Does that make sense? Uh, so I know it sounds like things are drab and not going well, but that's actually not the case. There's lots of goodness going on around here. That is kind of my feelings in all of the matter. I feel like now that I've gotten that off my chest, I can move on to all of the things. Um, the things that we're doing in the day, the different decisions that we've made and how the days have been going and sharing more of what's going on in this season, which has been really good. Uh, but life is something special. It really is. So, <laughs> yeah.